Hi, this is Patrick, the beer brewer. So we've boiled our wort, and now we're doing what's called wort chilling. I have two copper coils, one in the wort itself. I have a pump in another bucket, and then I have another wort chiller in this bucket with ice. The water goes, it's an internal water going in, and then of course water coming out, right there. And it takes me between 10 to 20 minutes to cool my wart. The top part here is hot, the bottom part is the cold coming in. It goes around and cools my wart which we want to bring down under 72 degrees. So I calmly stir it. You don't want to aggravate it. You don't want to oxygenate it until it gets to 80 degrees or under. Um, that could spoil your cold break in regards to the sugars in your wart. And as you can see, I've got my temperature. I'm almost at 80 degrees. Once I get to 80, then what I'll do is I'll go up and down with this, agitate it, and put more oxygen into my wort so that once I pitch my yeast, which will actually go into this carboys, and I'm using a Y yeast, I'm making a California pale ale, and as you can see it's an American ale yeast. And this is an example of one way many people chill their wort. Thanks for watching. And hopefully you've learned something in a new lesson in brewing beer.